Hello and welcome to Solid CAD. This is a very very simple part we are going to make. This is its drawing. As per drawing we will make this. This is very very simple and uh, I download it from Pinterest. You can download it too. So let's see how it's made. New part. Okay on the front plane I will draw a line from here like so and this this is 120 degree and this is 58 and radius is 22 22 plus 58 is the length from here to here let's define it 58 plus 22 and this is 120 degree as yes, per drawing 120 degree and this is 42 millimeter long this part so let's define it you see there is a green button on my uh, right side of this my my mouse if you click it it will this will never change the position it will remain the same always so this is 42 as per drawing is 42 now let's extrude it with thin feature I will use thin feature 10 millimeter 10 millimeter is the height of it this 10 millimeter reverse direction and this is 22 mil 44 millimeter total 22 millimeter radius it means it's 44 millimeter so we'll make it 44 in the mid plane so you can use the thin feature on the other hand you can uh, offset this and convert and join the lines is a lengthy procedure but this this is a simple one so this is one this is how we make it let's uh, fillet it full round fillet you see the enter sign on my mouse on the right if I click it I will go to another box click I will go to another box and this is how we made it this is 12 millimeter and 25 millimeter length of uh, this slot so let's make it this is the center 25 millimeter from 58 millimeter from here it means it is this in the center of this the slot so let's draw it send two point slot let's make this and this and this is 12 millimeter radius is 6 it is 12 you can see it is 12 okay this is 25 as per drawing you can see it here this is 25 and 58 from this to here to the center let's check is 53 we did something wrong let's go back 
okay let's go back use the thin feature and reverse direction it's okay now I will wake this up again it's 58 now you see this is 58 I made a mistake on thin, thin feature this is 58 millimeter now and everything is okay let's cut it through all let me make on the front plane I will draw a sketch a line from here to here this is 25 millimeter as per drawing you can see it's 25 from here and this uh, thickness is 6 millimeter okay it's fully defined let's go to rip feature it is 6 millimeter the direction arrow direction is okay the material inside okay so this is the rib all is left a few fillets and fillet is r10 both side so let's fillet it fillet this and this r10 okay now we'll make some holes here on this plane the hole is outer hole is 2 into 6 6 millimeter 12 millimeter uh, 6 millimeter deep 12 uh, 12 dia and dia and 3 millimeter deep and uh, internal one is six millimeter the inter in, in, internal bore is six millimeter okay let's make it six millimeter uh, it is 12 12 millimeter this is six millimeter and these both are same equal relation and these are equal relation the sketch is fully defined there is nothing left it's okay it is in the center of this rib this fillet so we don't have to dimension it so let's cut it first curve we will select the contour selection and we'll select this and this and through all cut this through all okay then again we'll select this sketch and extruded cut and this is only three millimeter as per drawing the part is complete let's give it a some color I think it's okay if it is zero I'll make it zero this is good this is nice color I like it I'm happy with that so this is a simple very very simple exercise you can do it at home at uh, your SOLIDWORKS with your SOLIDWORKS and uh, I hope you like it and enjoy this and uh, thanks for watching